So today we are in Henderson, Nevada, which is basically in the Las Vegas basin. And we're going to show you an incredible, and I mean incredible house, and I'm not going to tell you how much it is because I want you to guess, because you won't believe what the price is. You really won't. Don't cheat. Don't go to the end because we'll tell you then. We're going to go see Zach from Official Partners, and he's going to tell us a little bit more about the house. But like I said, don't cheat on the price. Let's go see. This is the main like entry into the front door. This isn't the front door. This is like a, a very zen area. Koi pond, there's no fish in it, but it is in fact a koi pond or could be a koi pond. And uh, yeah, here we are. This is also a house that's, when you're in the house, you're also outside the house. Does that make sense, Adam? It does, yeah. It's, it's kind, of, kind of crazy. This is the front door, but since this is open, we're gonna walk through here. Pocket doors that just disappear on I think every window in the house. Look at that. What a view. That crazy, so cool, Zach. Michael, How are you? good to see you. Good How to are see you? you too. Thank you for having us in yeah. this incredible house. Yeah, of course. Tell us about it. So we're just under 6,200 square feet, four bedrooms, five bathrooms. It's two story. We have 22 foot ceilings in this main living space. House was completed at the end of 2022. So barely lived in, almost basically brand new. All these doors down here, pockets. So the whole downstairs of the house is configurable to how you need to live. So this indoor is the outdoor. Even though it's only 6170 square feet, it lives so much bigger than that. You're almost touching 8,000 square feet. So, you know, you can configure it how you need to live. So it's All really the doors cool. pocket, right? All of these doors pocket. So they're basically not there. You can be inside, you outside. You can be inside, you can be outside. That outdoor bar area over there, that's outside. But we carried, the, we carried the floors all the way out. So you really get the same feeling of being in your kitchen or your living room, but you're actually outside. So there's a glass panel there. There's closes. a glass panel that completely pockets. But again, you're gonna get all the same warmth. You got uh, warmers in the ceilings, all the same lighting, TV, another fireplace out there. So the whole idea here is you go beyond the living space. Brilliant. Yeah. So we go take a look. I'm ready, mate. Let's do it. Thank you. Of course. Thank you. So this is really cool. I mean, really, really cool. Such an open space. I love this two faucet or taps as we call them. Isn't that fun? Yeah, it's cool. I like the little slidey yes. guy. Yeah, everything slides. Is this a cutting board? Mm, believe so. Yeah, a little drying rack. Nice. Colander. It's a great invention. So this is obviously the kitchen. It's got the two very large fridge freezer and a wine chiller. It's not a chiller. It's a wine refrigerator, I guess, right? Yeah, wine fridge. But that's not the whole kitchen. There's more kitchen, do you want to see? I do. Let's go see. Is it this way? No, it's this way. So this part of the kitchen, I did this completely backwards, but that's okay. So this is really like a prep kitchen. Coffee machine, you've got to have your coffee machine. I'm assuming dishwasher, microwave, and just uh, another place to prepare your food so it's not- This visible. is fun, isn't it? I love, that's, it looks like wood, but it's, it's metal. Isn't that good? I have to, I have to get one of those. Take a picture. Take a picture, hold on, I'm gonna take a picture. Excuse me, excuse me. That is very, very cool. Okay, picture. There we go, nice picture taken. And then this is the laundry room. Is it the laundry room? No, it's not the laundry room. There's no, it's doggies. Hi. <laughs> Hi, little doggy in there. Hi, so baby. just for everybody that's dog lovers like me and Michael, this is the owner's dog and it's just in there. Just while we film, yes. yeah. He's 18 years old. Oh. Bless him. What a good boy. What a good boy. He might not like me. <laughs> this is cool. Needless to say, we had a little preview tour of the house, but this is cool. So the owner of the house is an avid cyclist. How do you know? Like I said, we had a preview of the house, but I think this is a slight giveaway. What it's like a think? bike shop. These are expensive. They are. I mean, like, they probably weigh, what will that weigh? Nothing. Well, it weighs something. But I mean, barely. They're doesn't full look, carbon fiber. Doesn't look comfortable. No. But wow, this is phenomenal. And then you go through this door, check that out. Oh, so this is alkaline water. Brilliant, right? Yeah, yeah, look at that. The owner has saved 816 plastic bottles. Come in here and you have a three car garage. That's a cool car. So this is the first time I've seen this. This is the Taycan crossover. So it's like a little the, bit taller. The, what, do you, what do you call the 911 one? The Dakar? Dakar. Dakar? Yeah. And then there's another something back here. I'm not sure uh, what Rivian it is. R1. 
What is it? Rivian. Oh, Rivian, that's an interesting car. I like He's them. He's got all the tools here. Look at this. Oh yeah, look at that. That is fun. Nice car. So two electric vehicles. Two electric vehicles. I really like this. I'm not a huge electric vehicle fan, but that's cool. You've driven the Taycan, the, the like I drove the, one. the Taycan Turbo S. Yeah. Blisteringly fast, <laughs> but you can't hear it. No, no, no sound. They have that spaceship sound that yeah. they've added. Yeah. Like, yeah. Okay, let's continue. Have you noticed how like solid everything is? Everything like, is. Everything is just class, and it's got these. Um, there's a weight. There we go. Look at that. That's cool. Thought about, right? Beautiful. Okay, so this is something I have never seen before. I now know how it operates. Look at this television. Something there kind of impairs your view, doesn't it? <laughs> you ready for this? I'm ready for it. All right, watch this. Here we go. Whoa. Have you ever seen anything quite like this? So this is Bang & Olsen B&O, and this is the sound system. The TV is going up in the air. So it's not just the speakers that are opening, the actual TV is rising. I wonder how high it's gonna go. Is that cool? That's awesome. It would be very frustrating if you're watching something, you wanna get it right now and it takes five minutes <laughs> to, but it's worth it, look at that. That's very cool. And it's just like a normal TV that mounts onto the bracket on the back. It's so a heck you, of a system though, isn't it? It's amazing, yeah. That is really something. Okay, let me see if I can switch it off. Switch look at this, this is off. a nice touch. So. Oh, oh no, this is for the fireplace. I thought this was for... Um, what uh, did you the, think it was for? All the TV controls, like all the wire and everything oh, behind I, I it. I thought it was an orange juice dispenser. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> now this is majorly cool. This is actually outside, although you wouldn't know you were outside because it's enclosed except for the front and the cool fireplace. Isn't that fun? It's a warm fireplace. It throws out some heat, doesn't it? Yeah, this the is TV. awesome. It's like a little living room. Bar. And it's outside. Yeah. But you're inside. And this is it's so cool. So cool. We closed some of the doors. Vegas is having some wind today. I'm not being rude. <laughs> it's just very windy. But look at that view. Should we take another look at it? I think we should go outside. Well, there's more of the downstairs to see. I know, but you always do this. You tease people. Go on then. Go yeah, on. You, you come out as well. We'll come outside. This is so warm. It's a little chilly. How about this pool? Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh my God. This is spectacular, isn't yeah. it? And the view, and at night, the way that this will light up. I like the swan. <laughs> this one is cool. Did you see the swan? I did see the swan. I think he's a chlorine dispenser, maybe. Do you think? Well, he's got, you see underneath, he's got yeah, like a I little do. thing. He might be a little chlorine tablet okay, dispenser. Hold on, hold on. You know what I'm gonna do, right? <laughs> I need that. <laughs> I was taking a picture of you taking a picture. Oh, I thought you were like, taking a picture. It's nice, my... little Baja shelf. Yeah, Baja shelf's always good with the steps down. And then over here, we have an outdoor kitchen with a pizza oven. Yeah, this is brilliant. I, yeah, I would be out here all the time. These cook pizzas very fast, don't they? They do, yeah. Very fast. And then check this out. Lounge here in the sun, taking the view. Dog run down the side. Oh, for little doggies. Very nice. Very, it's very so nice. nice that you're really not overlooked. I mean, you've got these big boys over here, but... Yeah, they've got better things to look at, right? Look at the view. So pretty. Love these infinity pools. And this was actually built before the restrictions came in, so a lot of the new houses aren't allowed such a big pool up here, are right, they? Right, so Las Vegas and Clark County, the county where Las Vegas and Henderson is, they put a maximum pool size of 600 square feet. I'm guessing this is probably... 800 square feet. I'm guessing, I don't know, didn't measure it. It's water conservation, right? Because in the heat, it evaporates. It's a robot. <laughs> and then you have to come, you know, continually top it up so it's eating water. So the smaller the amount, the less the evaporation. Did you know I was a physicist? I didn't, no. no I didn't either, and I probably got that wrong. Three TVs, so you can watch multiple games at once. How did we get out here? Oh, through there, I remember. These are fun, they look like out of the back of a powerboat. I really like the landscaping here. I actually didn't realize that uh, lavender grew so well in the desert. Sorry, I'm... they're rattling when I you walk. I'm thinking, <laughs> you'll probably say, what's that rattling noise? It's Michael's Mint. This is amazing. It really is, it throws out some heat, doesn't it? Okay, let's continue. So 
so cool. I know, isn't it gorgeous? So cool. Okay, so we go this way. Just little things that have been really thought about. This is just pebbles, really, big pebbles, but they continued it outside. There's a piece of glass separating the house from the outside, and it continues, so it makes it look twice the length with a tree, olive tree. I don't know if it's an olive tree, it might be an olive tree. There's this little restroom down here. Oh, big restroom. Holy moly. See nice the size of the mirror? What is it? It's got a hoofing great big mirror in there. Where? Because all the way to the ceiling. It does. Above the sink. Oh wow, backlit. And the faucets come out of the mirror. Haven't oh, seen yeah. that before. Very nicely done. That's awesome. I love this little recessed, or what would you call that? Like the little drop down ceiling. Yeah, drop down ceiling with recessed lighting behind yeah. it. And then we have a guest suite with a breakfast kitchen. Is that what it's called? Breakfast kitchen? Was Morning it? kitchen? Morning kitchen. Morning kitchen. You have your two pull out freezer drawers or fridge drawers, sink, make your coffee. So lovely. Very zen, you look out over the like, entryway, which is a well, water feature. This is so nice. It's like a little mini compound, isn't it? Yeah, and there's a lot more of it to come. And you guys, I hope you're guessing how much this house is because I really do think you'll be shocked. And guess what I've remembered to tell them? What have you remembered? If they're not subscribed. Tell if them. they're not subscribed, yeah. what would you like me to tell we, them? Well, because we always say at the end, or you always say. Oh yeah, if you're not subscribed, Get a hold of yourself. Hit that button, subscribe now. Hit the like button. Say, we love this channel in the comments and guess how much this house is. How did I do, Adam? Brilliant. Excellent. I love this. It's like a screensaver. Won't burn the screen, right? I, it's on every TV in the house, so right. I'm guessing not. But it's so clear, like the viewing angle on this TV it's like is like 16K insane. instead of yeah. 4K, right? <laughs> Crazy. Okay, check out this bathroom. So this house has an interesting feature that you don't see very often. In fact, I don't think I've seen it at all. There is no glass partition from the shower. So literally, you just walk under here, you do your shower stuff in the, in the open. And this is on a slight slant, so the water all goes to the drain. But it just, it's just, it's wild, right? Yeah, it's interesting. It's like, where's the glass? How do I get in the shower? Well, I'm in it. <laughs> And then I suppose you could, you know, sit in the bathtub, tilt that so that you get a shower at the same time and it wouldn't matter what missed because it goes down the drain. Yeah, it is wild. I wonder if it was designed for that. Probably not. No, it's an it's, it's electric tub. It's got, oh, there you go. Yeah, I see the little... Jets. Yeah, it's got the uh, jacuzzi yeah. element. Where's the controller? Somewhere. On there, look. See it under the tap? There it is. There it is. Awesome. Okay. I like these tiles. I really like the uh, I do shape of them. So go in that closet and make a quick left. See if anything jumps out at you. Oh, gee, that's it, terrifying. Did you give me a shot? It looks like a little claw. Yeah, right, it was funny. <laughs> Look at that. I know. That just fun? a chair, but yeah, just this poking out. I know. I saw it earlier and it spooked me. It's like, <laughs> you've got to see that. Interesting. There are some random chairs like that around the house. Don't have the explanation for them, but I do want to comment on these because this is just brilliant. Never seen this before. Oh, oh, that doesn't move, but this does. <laughs> I thought these would swing left uh -huh. and right. Yeah, yeah. But that's pretty cool, right? Does it go up and down? Yeah, it does. Like... That's neat. I like and the symmetry. And they stay yeah. where you put them. How does it know? Well, it nearly stays. Yeah, anyway, it's got a like, counterbalance on it. I'll put it back where I found it. Come on. Okay, let's make a right turn. So this bedroom here, Adam. Sorry. No, that's fine. This looks so out of place, but also kind of cool. You wouldn't expect to see that 
in this house? No. Would you? No, but look, they've got a lot of sort of old art tapestry type stuff. It makes it eclectic, right? Yeah. It's kind of cool. I don't know if that would be my choice. <laughs> Probably not. Probably right. not. Okay, so here we have, I'm looking for chairs with crazy arms. <laughs> None of those. Closet. Then here we have another one of those showers. So this one, yeah. if you were having a difficult poop, you then can you actually can shower, shower while you're on the toilet, right? <laughs> Turn that and then... <laughs> Just use the body, look, look. No, there. <laughs> what, do you th what do you think about this? I mean, it's unique, it's yeah. different, um, it's fun. I would have to live with it for a few weeks. I think you'd get used to it quickly. Yeah. But initial thoughts are, where the heck's the glass, right? And I wonder how keeping everything clean sort of... Well, if you're showering here, I mean, it's going to splash over here, but it's on a slant. Yeah. So I guess all the water would come here. It's interesting. One way to find out. Buy the house for $400 million and there you, go. you can see. I wonder how those guesses are coming on. Okay, where are we going this way? Check out this media room. Cozy, fun, without being stupid. Because some of these houses have ridiculously large theaters in them, which realistically nobody uses, right? This is very nice. Very, very Again, nice. Again, I love the backlighting. Yeah, it's beautiful. And electric shades throughout the house. Everything is through a Crestron system. Oh, look, glass. Oh yeah. I guess the builder didn't get the message first time, right? <laughs> See, this to me is more normal, right? Makes more sense, doesn't it? Well, like I say, you might live with it and love it and say, why doesn't every house have that? But uh, yeah, it's very cool. And all the toilets, I don't know if you noticed, they're not down to the ground, they're side mounted. Floating. Which is also nice, easy to clean underneath them. Floaters. Floaters, floaters. Here we have another bedroom, which is also an office and that door there opens up to the bathroom we were just in and there's a closet here. What is that? Uh, it's a Bosu ball. I know that because it says that, but what does it do? Mm, maybe you do like little, when you sat in your office chair, you can... <laughs> is that what that's for? I mean, maybe. And keep the old calves going. Exactly. Right. Tell everybody about how you get on with your keep fit. No. Tell them what happened. So I knocked my back out and it's kind of sore, it hurts. It's just like really sore. Tell them how it happened. Trying to stay fit and healthy. So I was on my treadmill, have a gym, and I was there doing what you're supposed to do, doing five miles an hour on the treadmill. And then for whatever reason, the motor seized up. It just stopped and it threw me across the room and I landed flat on my back. It was like, if that would have been on TV, it would be like the biggest views ever. I was launched from this damn machine and it knocked my back out. So now trying to keep fit hurts you. So I don't recommend trying to keep fit, guys. <laughs> I have a question though. I have an answer. Why did it launch you backwards if it locked up? Surely if you're walking, right? And it's the treadmill's going like this and then it stops. Try it. You stand, like you step forward. It didn't, it threw me backwards. So did it go really fast all of a sudden? I don't know what it did. It threw me backwards. It stopped. I mean, it seized up. It was... But that's what I mean. So if you're like walking forwards on a treadmill, right? But the treadmill stops you from walking forwards because it's going back. If it stops, then it's just like walking on the floor. But it wasn't because I was doing five miles an hour. Had you had a little Baileys beforehand? No Baileys. No Baileys. But the moral of the story is don't try and stay fit. It's dangerous. <laughs> How about this? Isn't this beautiful? Yeah, this is awesome. It's like a bridge. The amount of heat those fireplaces give off. I'm roasting, mate. I I'm am too. There's roasting. no heat on in the house. It's freezing cold outside. And those fireplaces are the only source of heat. And oh boy, do they heat. Yeah, and definitely up here, it's hotter than down there. Yeah, well, heat rises. So you're not just a, what did you say? I, I, I paid attention in school. I'm a straight F student. <laughs> Look, see what I mean about the artwork? Very, very, very traditional antique art. Right, and you come in here, there's no fireplace going, it's freezing. Oh, it's nice though. It is nice. Okay, so here is another crazy shower. And this shower is on a crazier scale than the previous ones because it has body jets. Imagine you're here and the water is spraying across the room. I really want to turn it on to see uh, what you'll happens. Be my guest, I don't know if the owners will be pleased with that. Maybe it's just there to look at. I, I, I don't Because, I mean, seriously, like if that jets out, so, in my house, I have the body jets in the shower. 
It's actually just been completely redone, so it's no longer the way it was, but my body jets were against the door. So when you open the door, you get, everything would get drenched, it was badly designed. But at least it had a door to start up some of the water. This doesn't, I don't understand it. That's a very interesting concept. This yeah, and I think is this beautiful. is how you switch everything on. And I don't know how that works, and I'm not gonna do it because all sorts of th bad things might happen. <laughs> but isn't it cool to sit in your bathtub, watch TV, I, this is the first time I've seen a TV where you can shower and watch the telly. Shower, watch the telly, sit in the bath, watch the telly. It's a jacuzzi tub. This is a control for something, but I don't know what it is. The tub, do you think? Probably. Yeah, what make is it? Ben, Bain, yeah, Ban Ultra. Yeah, so that controls the tub. And these tubs are great. And then here we have a fabulous closet, which is like a, like a boutique, right? Got auto lighting. Everything is beautifully done. I won't own, open anything because it's the, the owner still living here. But wow, what a gorgeous, gorgeous house. This really is nice. Isn't Very it? special. Right? And again, like fit and finish of everything is so good. So if you didn't know, and I know it's difficult for you now to guess, how much would you guess this house is? Double digits, millions. How many double digits? Don't say. Okay. Let everybody guess. Okay. When shall we reveal it? At the end. Good point. Shall we make it the end? Should yeah. we go outside? Yeah, we've got to go on the balcony, haven't we? Let's go outside on the balcony. We haven't even shown them the master yet. We walk straight in You're here. absolutely right. I don't know where I am today. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I didn't see it. I was looking for a door. Another morning kitchen, breakfast kitchen, morning kitchen. I like morning kitchen. Yeah. Make your cappuccino. And here is a mini dishwasher. I that's so cool. That no, no, that's really nice. And then these are two, I'm assuming, drawers, yeah, Bridges. freezer drawers, fridge drawers. So yeah, you get up in the morning, you come make a little Whoa. cup of tea, and then... Look at this. Yeah, this is quite the view. Quite the view. Spectacular. That is the Dragon Ridge Golf Course. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I hope you enjoyed this beautiful house in Eskaya, which is next to McDonald Highland, because that's the McDonald Highland Golf Course, Dragon Ridge, I think. Gorgeous. Guess how much it is, shall I tell them? Tell them. How much is it? I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it eight, eight million? I think it's eight million, eight, yeah. Eight point. I think it's eight. Hold on, let's, I'll go and ask. Oh God. <laughs> Another yeah. professional house tour by yeah, right? Michael and Adam. So I'm sure many of you have probably guessed 20 million, 30 million. You ready? It is eight million, nine hundred, $95,000, which means it's $5 less than $9 million. How did I do? Does that mean it's $5 less? 8 million, 900, no, 50, 500, <laughs> 8 million, 999, nine. It's just under $9 million, guys, uh, and it's a bargain. I think this is a bargain. It's a lot of money, but it's a bargain for the house you get, with the view you get. So stop writing your checks. And this is one of the most exclusive communities in uh, sort of, I know it's not Las Vegas, but Henderson, Las Vegas area. Yeah, Henderson is like very high end. Um, if you don't want the craziness of Las Vegas, you live in paradise. And then if you want to go to the strip, it's only like 20 minutes or not even 15 yep. minutes, depending on traffic. Tell them the car we saw on the way in. A Bugatti, a matte black Bugatti, careering down the road right towards us. Adam managed to miss it which was a good thing, because that would have been a but crash. But it was a sheer on, wasn't Rather it? than a crash. It would have been a crash. That's the posh way of saying crash. Whatever. Hit the subscribe button, hit the bell. We're in it to win it. And yeah, hope you did well with your guessing. Bye.